Well, okay, old goats. Today we're going to make another flower bed. Uh, this one is going to contain our berry bushes. Uh, we got one berry bush planted. We got to go get some more. Uh, you know, we were thinking about what we wanted to do with it, and we decided berry bushes. So, yeah, Chris is not running around. So we're going to do. I show you how to do a mulch bed. Uh, the last that last video I did of how to make a mulch bed got quite a few views and uh, did really well. Uh, but it was done with the old camera, which is not as good quality as this one. So we'll go ahead and get started. So the first thing you want to do with the mulch bed is you want to figure out where you want your bed to be. Now in here, there are some flowers in here somewhere. A uh, whole lot of grass too. So we're just going to figure out where we want to be because we want this bed curve around and shoot up both sides of the rug. Because I think that'd be pretty and it kind of breaks the yard in half. So you gotta put your spade in the ground. You want this part, you know how it's, you can see how it's angled here. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe you can't. But you want this straight part straight up and down. So you gotta lean the shovel just a little bit forward. Figure out where you want it to be. Kick it in, put your foot behind it because you don't want to disturb the ground behind it. You want it to be a nice, even, good cut, straight down. Pick up your waist, throw it in the wheelbarrow, get lined up right beside it again, get your shovel straight again, check her down, and we're gonna go down a little deep. We're gonna go down just a little deep. It's gonna like keep going all along where you want your bed to be. Not overly difficult. It's really simple. <coughs> now as you're making a turn or curve, you can see there's a little bit of a curve here. But you just put it in there at a slight angle from where you were. Curve on around. We'll do this curve for you. That way you can see how easy that is. Curve the shovel a little bit as you go. Just up the area you want. What you end up with. Is a nice little curve area the edge of your bed. You can just pull the grass out. That's right there along the edge. Some of that's from the taller stuff on the outside. I should have mowed first, but we've got a little one running around. Think so. you notice it's not perfect, but like in nature, nothing's perfect. So it don't have to. We're gonna go ahead and get this cut out. We'll catch back up with you guys here in a little bit. All right, guys. And when you're done with that part, you'll have your trenches and a well-defined what's gonna be your bed. And we'll catch back up with you here in a little bit to show you the next step. This next step, you're just gonna turf the grass. And uh, part in the mess right here, I had a fire pit right here years ago. And you can see there's all kinds of uh, burnt stuff left over from when I had that. But I'm just gonna get up underneath that grass. And there's all kinds of roots in this part because I didn't get the whole stump out. You're just gonna get up underneath of it, pull her out, put her in the waist. <coughs> it's not overly hard, you just keep pushing along. I mean, that shovel's got that straight edge on the back of it. Straight edge right here. Always keep that level. 
it'll pop bubble that up right up underneath of it. It's going to do that for the entire bed, the entire length, the entire width. Get all that grass out of there. And we're going to try to leave the flowers in. Uh, some of them are buried in the in the grass. There is flowers there. So we're going to try to leave all those in so we can dig them out later and transplant them somewhere else. Because this bed is going to be uh, where our Oh, fruit bushes are. So, we don't want the flowers in there. Anyway, we'll get done on this and we'll catch back up with you guys later, okay? Alrighty, old goats. As you can see, we got all the grass out. And, well, we're not going to mulch it. We're not going to put the uh, cloth, the landscaping fabric down because we don't have mulch. And what we're going to do in this bed is we're going to put the uh, berry bushes. I think I already said that. But next step is going to be to uh, connect this bed to the other bed on the other side. But that's a different day. This will stay the way it is for now. We'll do what we got to do. Anyway, ah.